So what I did was embark on a bit of a, a journey and a bit of a, a learning curve for me in terms of how to try and improve shooting. And I'm gonna share a lot of that with you tonight. Um, and what we'll, what we'll probably end up doing is actually breaking it down to some of these guys individually. And I'll show you some of the little secrets that I learned um, that will no longer be secrets. Because I, I work with a guy in Canada called David Love and uh, he was tremendous. He's a NBA shooting coach um, and we had numerous Zoom calls over individuals, over little techniques to try and improve shooting. And uh, that, that some of the strategies I'll show you tonight. Um, what I'll say is before we start, it's not a one size fits everyone. When I, when I grew up uh, playing basketball myself, my coach told me, get your elbow underneath the ball. No matter what, get your elbow underneath the ball. Shoot like that. But that's not a natural feeling. So that, that's just one example. Of, that doesn't suit everybody. So like having, and I'll explain a little bit more as I go, there's techniques and things to, to make it more natural, but everyone's different. If I'm seven foot tall, I'm gonna shoot it differently. I'd love to be seven foot tall. I'd like to be six foot, to be honest. Um, but th there's, there's different, like, the different body mechanics, everything else like that, um, that people have. So you have to, you have to really look at shooting and, and teach it differently for every single person. Um, so what, uh, yeah, what does it mean? When I started with the COE, I had 10 athletes, 10 unique shooting styles. Uh, we, I didn't, I, we st I still have 10 athletes with 10 unique styles, but what we have is a situation that they're starting to get a higher percentage, their form looks better, and there's little things. And what we call, what I call the non-negotiables. So non-negotiables are shooting lines. And I'm gonna, again, I'll fly into this with these guys and get them going in a minute. But I'm gonna bring you out onto the baseline and I'll explain so you can get a better angle and see what I'm talking about. Um, <clears throat> first thing we're gonna do is I'm gonna talk about kinetic flow and energy into a shot. So what I'm gonna, every, I just want you to come over this, stand up in front of everyone here. Just go face these guys. Okay, what we're gonna do is, is this. So I just want you to lock in, show me your shooting technique. Put the ball down for a sec. Show me how you're about to shoot it. Now, now shoot it, go. See, what it, every, nearly every person was different then. What you saw was as the, as the ball lifts, some people lifted back, some people shot the ball here. Some, it, was, it was a completely different lineup. What I'm saying is the kinetic energy and kinetic flow in a shot needs to have, be all positive. If I start here and I lift back, what if I, what if I generate, what I, want, I want to get all the power from my legs, okay, from my quads, from my glutes. So now as I shoot the ball, okay, I stay in that positive energy right through till I finish my shot. I want you to do this little experiment for me, guys, okay? I want you to go roll your knees forward, like that, and jump, go. Now what I want you to do is drop your glutes and jump. Which feels more powerful? Sorry, second one. Second one, so sit forward, engage your glutes, ready? Jump again. Now, sit like that, roll back, and jump, go. So a lot of you guys now, show me how you're gonna shoot the ball. Go, sit forward, engage your glutes, left, yep. Good, so lock your feet and head into your shot, go. Okay. What I'm gonna do right now, jump on the baseline, let's go. We're gonna, you guys dance it all. Dance, spread out, spread out, don't be shy. What I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna teach them about kinetic flow and energy before we start shooting. So, what all I want you to do, I'll try not to drop the mic here, but you're gonna come out, you're gonna lock in, you're gonna jump this way, come over here. We're gonna dance this way. Good, I'm gonna get you to spin. Jump this way, okay? Up to you now, to halfway, go. Feel the flow, feel the energy, good, jump. Jump as high as you can on each one, spin. Good, good, good. Don't lean back, keep the flow, keep the energy there. Good, good, go, go, back again, this way. Go, 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 go. Good, hold there. When you jump, I want you to keep your, 
Try and land in the same spot. Go, here we go. Spin, spin, be creative. Good, now I asked the girls in the COE to sing a song as they did it. They sang Dancing Queen. You guys wanna do that? Not really, hey. But the idea is that energy, that positive energy. So I'm gonna, I hit the floor. I'm gonna push the floor away. I'm gonna lift my hips quick. I'm gonna keep that power. If I spin and I lean back or I roll my knees forward, then I get, I got nothing here. There's no power in your quads left. Do it again. Where do you lose the power in your legs? So as you lift, where's the power in your legs gone? Sit forward again. Put your hand up as you lose, go lift back. Put your hand up as you lose it, yeah. Everyone feel that. I want you to do it again. I want you to keep that positive energy. Imagine you're shooting a jump shot, go. Flow, dance, spin. Good. Go, 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 spin, good, good. Nice job, like that one. Good, spin, good, good. You guys aren't very creative at dancing, eh? Let's go back again, here we go. Go, 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 spin, spin, spin. Be smooth out here, let's go, here we go. A little bit of swagger amongst it, let's go. Do you notice again though, you see as they're doing it, they're, they're rolling and lifting their body back. We want you to lock in. So this is gonna come from here. Sit forward on it. Everyone got that? Okay, grab a ball now, let's go. We're gonna go more of in a straight line now. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna throw it, quick, 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 hustle, hustle, go, go, go. We're gonna throw it out. We're gonna chase it, we're gonna lock in. I'm gonna go one, two, we're gonna shoot on three. Forward, one, two, shoot on three. And what I'm concentrating on is that positive energy going forward into my shot. Go, here we go. Lock your hips down. Don't lift your body. Good, good, nice. Okay, on the way back, watch. One thing I want you to concentrate on. As the ball lifts, my body, I'm lift, as I lift my body, the ball lifts with it. Okay, so we're not going, we're not up, and then shooting on the way down. We've got a positive energy towards the ring, go. Rhythm, good. Good, don't roll back, don't roll back, feel that flow. Okay, everyone got that? Could I get a line out here quickly? A line out here quickly and a line in the middle. I'm gonna let you start shooting the ball now. Line in the middle, okay. We'll work this end. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna throw it out three times. So you're gonna chase it. You're gonna lock your feet and head in, do your shot. Okay, we'll work on upper body in a minute. Second one, we're gonna chase it, lock in. Feet and head, energy here. I'm not rolling forward, I'm locking my hips down. Third one, we're gonna lock our hips down then we're gonna lift and shoot the ball with that positive kinetic energy, kinetic flow, ready? Here we go. But yep, go, 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 good. Lock in, good, here we go. And shot, nice, good, good, here we go. Next one, quick, quick, hustle back, go, go, go. Lock in, good, good. You're lifting your body back, keep your, see how you, see how we roll back, we'll work on this in a minute. Go, go, next one, here we go. Good, stay forward, stay forward, good, good. Nice, next one, go, 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 here we go. Good, good. Nice job. Go, go, go. One more. Good. Okay, hold there. We'll work on upper body in a minute. Well, a couple of you. So these are, what I, what I talk about is shooting lines. Just hold, pause there for a second. So non-negotiables with, with feet initially when you're teaching kids to shoot the ball. Uh, feet square. I'll give you an example. Uh, I'll, I'll mention a young lady called Isla Jaffermans. Great New South Wales player. What she had was she here, she wouldn't use her legs at all. What was happening was the, the, she lost that kinetic flow, that energy out of her legs. What was happening was because she lifted early, everything from here up was now working. So now as she shot it, she was ending up like this. So what we got her to do is understand the importance of pushing the, pushing the floor away, lifting her hips quick, and being engaged and keeping your head. So what, what happened was from this first video we took to now, it's like this. And the balance and the energy 
and the kinetic flow has been there with her shot. What I'm saying now, non-negotiable, shooting lines. So feet straight, shoulders square. From here to here, I, I can put a ruler on that. Okay, I can put a ruler on that. And I'll show you some upper body stuff in a minute. Now as I load, I've got my line here, my index finger through my line of vision. So straight, straight, line of vision, finger straight, through there. Now what I've got, if, I, every, if I've got everything straight, what's the ball gonna do? What's the ball gonna do? It's gotta go straight. So to me, a lot of this makes sense. I keep my thumb and my, on my left hand, my guide hand through my line of vision on my left. I put my index finger through my line of vision on my right. So now as I lift, I finish, I keep everything straight. The ball has to go straight. What I'm seeing here, where uh, I'll just get you to demonstrate for me. Just what I'm, I'm gonna correct you just now with your footwork. Go, so throw it out. Good, chase it, good. Good, go again. Okay, can everyone, can everyone see, and I'm, this is, I, I told you I'm going to do this. He, do, he, obviously great, quick young athlete, but if we now adjust your feet to be square, see where the ball starts as a right-handed shooter. If we now adjust this to your right eye, put this hand here, okay, now lift the ball. Now we've got a better chance of it going straight. Because it starts on the wrong side of your body, you bring it across. So no pressure, I want you to go through one more throw. Throw it out, straight feet, and lift, lift through that right eye and shoot it. Do you notice what happened? As you lifted the ball, you lifted your back, okay? Go one more for me, quick, quick, let's go. Everyone join in, same time, let's go. Concentrate, lock in, get your shooting lines right. Go, 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 here we go. Throw it out, good, that's better. Bring it up through that line, much better. Good. I think we should give him a clap, well done. Nice job. Not very enthusiastic about it, were they? Hey, was that, was that, did that feel better? Did that feel better? Okay, good job, very good. So what, I, what I'm saying again, those lines, once you've established that, then start thinking about your step backs, then start shooting off one leg, then start doing your fadeaways, your NBA, the stuff they see on the TV. But until they have a basis, I encourage you to concentrate on getting them straightened out. And you're not the only one here. There's a number of players here. We've got, to, we've got to try and straighten them out a little bit. This time, what I'm going to get you to do, we're going to work on that footwork now. So I'm going to get you moving a little bit. Three-point line, three-point line. I'm going to get you to run, lock in straight lines. I'm going to make sure my head stays over my feet. I'm going to lock and snap, shoot it, and then jump back in line. So you're going to go on the 45 a little bit more. Okay, running in, go, 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 run in. Good, good, and shoot it, good. Here we go. Next one, go, 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 go. Good. Nice, good, good. That's better, it's not coming off that side of your body. Good job, mate, really good. 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 Okay. And hold there. So there's a, there's a starting point for a solid base. And what we're trying to do now, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take it sideways now. I'm gonna actually start working on upper body. So if you notice this, uh, how, how, do you how do you evaluate a shot? If I'm a player, or I'm a coach, what's the, what's the one thing you should look at more than anything? Uh, when you, when you, what, what do you evaluate? Sorry? The arc, yeah. So what do you say? Basically, you, the ball. So who wants to be our first demonstrator here? Who wants to be, who wants their shot evaluated? Yeah, go for it. Could I, everyone jump on the, like everyone come on the baseline now, you guys stay right where you are. I'm just gonna show you what we're talking about now. So come right in here. And one, maybe once, that, yeah, that'll do. Okay. What we're gonna do, we're gonna, we're, gonna, we're gonna critique you. And I asked who, who would step forward and do that, okay? What I want you to look at right here is, uh, go for it. I want you to take a couple of shots, go, go, here we go. Good, yep. You guys are gonna jump in with this drill in a sec. Good, there you go. Keep going, good. And again, 
Kate, what do you what do you see? 70-30, Yep. So there's a little bit of movement with his hands. I'm gonna I'm gonna look a little bit f first at the what's happening. Where did you hit? Where did when you shot the ball? Where did it hit most times? What the last one in particular? Where did it hit? Front, rim. front of the rim. So why did it hit the front of the rim? Uh, not Sorry. Yep. Not enough power. Not enough power. Yep. Yep. What I what I saw. Okay. And when you shot it, okay, you lifted and rolled back. So now the mechanics are as I go to shoot the ball, my elbow is below my eye. So now what I now what you have it's a it's a like a flow on effect. I lift, lift the ball, lift my body, I lift my back. Now what I'm doing, I'm gonna fall through. And you, you end up with a little bit of twist here as well. But what I want you to do this time, I want you to lock in. We'll correct this bit first. Lock in, come through, shoot the ball, ready? I'll, I'll just get you if you can, thank you. Here we go. So stay forward, stay forward, stay engaged, good. Good, you roll back a little bit. That's better though, stay forward, not, you won't. Good, nice. I want you to lift your hips quick. So low, get your glutes involved, good, nice. I have three switches in a row, I think I win, don't I? Beautiful. Okay. Now, what do you see? They say it's better. We get, we know, there's no roll forward, no roll back. Now what we want, we want to we wanna get the, this straightened up a little bit here. Okay? So what I'm going to get you to do, I'll get everyone to come in, come around the, make a semicircle around the back. You're our main shooter right now. Keep going around here. Yep, stay engaged with this. We want to get you straightened out a little bit. So what we're going to do is, well, one finger on the, on the valve like that, okay? What we're going to do is work on the revolutions of the basketball. And one thing, there's a study done, someone maybe made up, I don't know, but Steph Curry has the most revolutions of any player in the history of the game. So when he shoots the ball, the backspin on the ball is elite. And you don't see any logos. So if I shoot it like that, I see logos. If I get that elite backspin, I don't see logos anymore. So what I'm getting every, each of you to do, on your index finger, have your hand in front like that, just one finger, shooting the ball, go. One finger, one finger only, one finger on the valve, don't shoot it at the ring, just to yourself. So here, one finger on the valve, like that, everyone got me? You're gonna spin the ball off your finger, go. Good. One finger only, one finger only. One finger, good, spin it, good. Okay, evaluate the spin as you do it, go. Good, how's your spin? Fantastic, it is, it's really good, go, go. How was your spin then? The ball was kind of funky, wasn't it? Yeah, 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 so we gotta get it straight, go. Straighten it up, good. How's your spin going? A bit to the right. So now, why we, why we do that drill is to get the feeling of, that's the last finger it's gonna touch. And what I'm saying is, it's not one size fits all. Some people shoot off two fingers. Some people shoot off their middle finger. Whatever they do, they've got to get the revolutions in the backspin right. So now I had my whole hand. So now as I shoot it, okay, the sensation of it coming off that finger needs to be there. So what I want you to do is rip it through. And then I want you to evaluate the spin on the ball. Go. Good. Can anyone see any funky spin or logos? I can see logos on yours, you're not, you're not snapping your wrist enough. Hold there. Now, I want you to get in tune with what we're doing. A lot of you now are rolling back. Okay, what I want you to do is engage. Lock your feet and head in, go. Stay forward, lots of spin. Good, nice. Stay forward, lots of spin. Good. Don't roll back. Okay, point your feet to the rim. Straight, straight, straight shoulders. I'm going to put two glasses of water on your shoulders right now. Don't spill them, go. Good, okay, I want you to lift your hips. Go, go, that come out of your hand funny. Good, now, what we want is this. Guide hand, okay? So we're gonna, we're gonna shoot in a second. So I'm loading, the, what the guide hand does, okay, it sits on the side of the ball. What I'm gonna do is basically lift both and I'm pushing through, okay? That's, that's really important, so I want you to concentrate on that right now, then we're gonna shoot some shots, go. So lift it, shoot it to yourself. You're gonna do this three times. One, two, three, and have a look, go. One, good, good, spin it, good. Okay, one of the, one of the non-negotiables we have at the COE, we talk about shaka life, okay? 
when you, if you see the girls at the top, they'll go like this at me, and then you think it's, what, what, what the hell are they doing? What, I, what we want when you finish is to keep that, that's a non-negotiable, that's one of the lines. I, I shoot it, I keep that. What is, a non, what is a negotiable is where your fingers end up, okay? Jazz Shelley played for Nebraska this year. She shoots the ball and she finishes with that finger down. Other people shoot and put a lid on the ring. I taught that for a long time. I, as a kid, I was taught, put your hand in the cookie jar. Okay, what I'm saying is, keep your thumb and pinky wide. That gets maximum backspin on the ball. But these three fingers, it's, that's a, that's a, to me, that's a negotiable part. Okay? Let's concentrate on shark. So shark a lot. At the end of this, I want to see you going like this. Ready? Here we go. Ready? Go. Left, shot. Good. Left, shot. Okay, can I get one line, two lines, three lines, four lines, five lines? Move to the front of the line, shoot it, move to the end of the line. Jump, jump in there. Good, good, here we go. Go, 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 go. Good. Go, 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 here we go. Okay, hold there. Just move back a bit. I'm gonna, I'm gonna grab, do you mind if you, you not shy, are you in front of everyone? Okay, jump here. Just lift behind, guys. I'm gonna get you to start here. I just want you to take a few shots, go. Good. So remember, remember. So what we're looking at, rim, rim. Okay, what was the, and uh, we're gonna basically, we're looking at what we're, where it ends up on the rim, okay? We, we want to find a remedy at the end of this, okay? Let's go, here we go. So look at the rim, good, go again, here we go. Nice job, good adjustment, good, good, here we go. Good, what did you see on the first time you shot the ball though? What, what's going on there, what do you reckon? Anyone wanna, what do you see? What I see is this, so as you lift, your body lifts, you separate it and your elbow below your eye. So I want you to engage, lock in, lock in here. As you lift, come through, brush your eyebrow, come through. The shooting line, my index finger is gonna stay through my right eye, my, my guide hand is gonna come through here and I'm gonna finish on the rim. So stay, sit forward, sit forward, here we go. Good, that's better, good, go again. Lock in, lock in, good, good. Okay, join a line, let's go. You're gonna shoot one, move on. Let's have a look at each person, here we go. Shoot one, good. Hold there, do that again, do that again. I, I referenced, what, was, what, did, what did you see with that? What happened on the rim? Uh, How was the, what else did you see? Uh, the spin kind of went off. The spin wasn't on, there was no spin at all, was there? So how, let's go, think about how we're gonna fix this. Good, come back, go back, do it again. So you're still lifting your body. I want you to lock your, lock your head in, come through and shoot the ball, ready? Here we go. What do we have there again? Yeah, yeah, you're, you, and what about the spin on the ball? Yep, side. So we're gonna adjust your hands now. So I want your index finger on the valve. Actually, everyone do this for me, put the ball down for a sec. One way of finding the natural position, I think, of the elbow, is if you put your fingernail in front of your right eye right now. If you're a left-handed shooter, do opposite. Keep your fingernail in front. What I want you to do is move this around until there's a straight line with your thumb and your pinky. So see how we want that? Straighten that finger out. That's about ideal position of your elbow. Okay, I'm gonna add this to here. I'm gonna bring that back. Okay, now I'm gonna basically get your shoulder square. Okay, now lock in, lock in, lock in. Good, good. Now that's, now I want you to shoot the ball with remembering, remembering the spin that you got with that one finger, go. What did this hand do? So you're pushing with two. So now we're gonna another another solution here. So now get that, so find that spot. Find, don't move your shoulders. Relax, relax, relax. Put your finger in front of your eye. Now I'm gonna put this on here. Okay, bring this other hand up. Now hold that on the side. Take your fingers off the ball. Put your palm on it, take your fingers off. Take your, yep, come in, move in a little bit more. Take your fingers off the ball here, just with your palm. Now you're gonna lift, same thing, you're just gonna push through. Ready? Not bad, getting better. What did this hand do? Still pushing. So what I'm saying, 
Se Sephron Shields, who you know, was a two-handed shooter. Couple of strategies, we took the fingers off. Next thing, you're gonna lift. Now, you, this isn't straight. The ball's not straight in your hand. See, the ball's sitting here in his hand. So now already, we're gonna, we're gonna like that, we're gonna shoot with two. So I want that hand underneath. Relax, good. There, add the other one, take that off. Now what we're gonna do is take the pinky off this side. So your, your hand's still not straight. See how the angle, so straight line, there, beautiful. There, we're gonna take the pinky off. Take that off, take that off. Okay, that on the side, a bit more, up off your palm. So you're gonna push the ball back up onto his palm. Keep that thumb on, keep that thumb engaged. Take that one off. Okay, now, here we go, shoot that. Good, come back, do it again. So what, we, what, we, what I want you to concentrate on, you're taking that, all we're gonna do is take that one off, okay? Now that sits it in the middle of your hand so you get that nice rotation on the ball. It's in the middle, yep, take your pinky off. Hold there, the ball's not in the middle. That's better, good, here we go. Why is, why is it coming out with no spin? One little, one little thing to do now. So you don't let me down on this one. Okay, ready? So finger, good, there. What I'm gonna do here, the ball's sitting on the base of his palm. So I'm just gonna push the ball up. Now I want you to shoot it, go. Okay, go back. Now I want you to do this. We're gonna go one finger, like that. Now we're gonna go three. One, two, three. And the fourth one, I'm gonna get you to spin it, go. So one finger, good. Spin it, good, good, good. Keep, I want, shaka, shaka. Keep it wide. Okay, hold there. The ball's gonna sit in the middle. Here we go. Go. Good. 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 Now shoot it. Here we go, same thing. What happened? I'm, I'm gonna leave now. I'm gonna leave you on the... Well, so we gotta get that... We, hey, let's go, you got this now. Here we go. Move in a little bit. Here we go. So spin it, good. The ball's gotta sit up on that. Okay, don't roll back. Good, good. You got this now. Okay, you're, hey, you're rolling back, you're rolling back. Stay forward, stay forward. Do the same thing, stay forward. One, lift your hips, good, two, good. We're gonna shoot this one, here we go. Hey, is that a better outcome than the earlier one? Absolutely, do it again, here we go. Stay forward, so hold here. You're rolling your knees forward, you're losing your, sit forward, engage that, good, good, go. One, two, three, one. Lift your hips, lift your hips, lift your hips, good. And we're gonna shoot this next one, ready? Shoot this next one. Okay, what happens when you're following through? One more, one more. Spin the ball the other way. Yeah, 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 yeah. So concentrate here, so get that straight. Keep all fingers, sit the ball up on your fingers, not on your palms, sit the ball up on your fingers. This thumb's gonna sit there, this one's sitting around here. Okay, go. One, good, that was perfect, good. Don't roll back, don't roll back. Don't roll, lift your hips, stay good. Here we go. Okay, someone else wanna have a go, quickly. Let's go, quick, quick. Go, 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 go. We'll work on that a little bit, little bit more. Here we go. Go, 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 yep. Good, shoot, we're gonna shoot it just straight, shoot it straight away, go, go, go. Good, nice, here we go. So I want you to practice right now. Practice that, go, 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 here we go. Grab a ball, grab a ball. Here we go. Next one, go. Next one. Good, what do you see? A little bit of backspin, not enough. So what I want you to concentrate on, your feet are so wide, you get, you don't, I want you to get more power by just shoulder width apart. So you're gonna try and get your shooting line straight. Right, so thumb, so to the side. Index finger down the middle. So now I'm lifting and I'm gonna follow through. Straighten your feet, good. Turn that toe. Yep, done that, done. so straight. Turn that one straight, good, good. Now, now hold there, your shoulder, balance up. Now, ball to the middle. Okay, now I want you to shoot it, go. Good, now, the, now concentrate on, so we're gonna get that one finger spin. Let's go, one finger only, one finger only. Better, good, that was better. Here we go. Nice, nice job, go again. Good, here we go, one more. Here we go. 
All right, come back in, quick. I'm gonna get you to do one little drill right now. I thought, it, this is another little drill that, about rhythm and timing. So I'm gonna, what I'm gonna get you to do is go like this. You're gonna go around, and then you're gonna lift and then shoot the ball, okay? So feel the rhythm of this, like, you so say you're out here in front of you, you're gonna go around, up, and straight through. Good, do it again. Around, good, up, better. Good, do it again. Keep your hands in front. Around, good, good. You didn't make the six then, so go around and back up. Make that six, here we go. So you're leaning back again. Concentrate, stay forward. Good, good, here we go. Around, good, around. So again, now spin on the ball. Concentrate. You got it. the first one was perfect. Here we go, ready? So out, out, around, lock and snap. That was better. Who else, quick, quick, quick. Then we'll get into a couple of drills. Go, go, go. Sit forward, good, good. So where's your hands? So we go finger on the valve. So we try and develop the shooting lines here. So here, this one's on the side. Yep, you're just gonna basically get that so your hand's in position there. Can everyone see? Now the ball sits in the middle rather than you're still to the side. So hand under the ball, good. Now we're gonna go, go, go. That feel really funny? Yep. How did it spin out of your hand? One more, one more. Then we'll get into a couple of drills, guys. Good, okay. Could I get uh, one rebounder? One rebounder here, one shooter there, one shooter there. Uh, same at the other end. Here we go. You have to stay. Uh, so pair up, pair down there. You're gonna go by yourself, just shoot in the middle. Yeah, you can sit down if you like now. So what I'm gonna, what you, what I'm gonna get you to do, you're gonna bounce off the three-point line, you're gonna come back and shoot it. You're gonna sprint, bounce off the three-point line, come back and shoot it, okay? First, first player, so rebounder, shooter. First player to six. Are you ready? Go, 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 here we go. Good, that, I like the backspin. Here we go. Good, good, keep working, keep working. Go, 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 go. First to six. No backspin again, concentrate, here we go. Finger through the ball. Six, change over, quick, quick, go, 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 go. Go, 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 here we go. Good. Hold there. We're, I want you to focus on your shooting lines again. So the basis of what we're doing, you're coming in, your feet are gonna be straight, shoulders square, I'm locking in, my head and feet are locked in. I'm gonna lift my hips and I'm gonna finish. Okay, here we go. Good. More backspin, remember that one finger drill. Here we go. Good, nice job over there. Nice job in the middle. Concentrate on your shooting lines. Good, good, nice job. So one of, one, of the, one of the things right now, I'm now in my head, I'm trying to develop a strategy around, because I, I don't think I've taught that young man how to shoot the ball yet. So in my head, I'm thinking of strategies, how I'm gonna do that. Because again, one size fits all. So I'm gonna try another couple of drills here to show you how I try and isolate it and break it down. Come this end, quickly. We're gonna, everyone grab a ball. Everyone needs a ball, everyone needs a ball. Quick, quick, this time. We're gonna go half at that end, half at this end. But watch what I'm doing first. We're gonna start on the charge circle. I'm gonna load. So I'm getting my feet, feet set and ready. What I'm gonna do is get to my set point. So I'm gonna lift and get to my set point. What I'm gonna do is separate. I'm gonna count one, two, three. Then I'm gonna lift, lock and snap. Everyone got me. So now what we're concentrating on, we're gonna isolate this, isolation drill. We're gonna lift to the set point. We're gonna separate. One, two, three, lock and snap. Both ends, go, 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 here we go. So now what I'm trying to do is just isolate that part of the follow through because I haven't been successful. And that's part of the fun of teaching shooting. 
Like I, I've got to, where, where's the, I'm going to get to that. There was backspin on that young man shot that time. So we're, good, lock and snap. Good, good, better. Isolate, hold three seconds. Detail guys. One, two, three, shoot it, good. Now we're in trouble. Lock, one, two, three, shoot it, good. Nice job. See that, again, you're see, you see some funky shooting lines. So the hands are like this, the ball's not sitting in the middle. We want that sitting in the middle with the index finger. So just do that, to try that now, right now. Have a look where, where that point is, where your thumb and your pinky are straight. So then I can shoot it with that line, okay? Rim, what's the second one? <laughs> Reason, that's what, <laughs> mental blank. Okay, this time, move back, move back. We're going to, I want every shot now. Rim, reason, remedy. So now, as I shoot the ball, where's it going if it hits the front of the ring? What have I done? I haven't followed through and extended. I've lifted back, my elbow's below my eye. So I want to be in a situation where I lift, lock, snap, my elbow's above my eye. So now I want you to go through that process. Where does it hit on the rim? Why, what's the reason for hitting that spot? And then find a solution. Got me? Here we go, let's go. So don't, just make sure to sit forward, engage, engage, activate your hips, good. Nice, that's better, nice job, excellent, that's much better. Good. Don't roll back. See the young man I'm talking to, Black Singlet. He's starting to get there. He, he was lifting back and falling away. Now he's locked in. He's starting to get some idea of what we're talking about. Stay forward. See that? That's much better. Now what we're going to do is extend and get it above the rim. Probably if you watch that young man a little bit more, he's losing the kinetic flow. What he's doing is lifting and pausing and then he's shooting the ball. So he's, everything that he's done with his lower body, he's lost. So what, we're trying to, what I'm trying to get, gonna get him to do is lift and flow through the motion. Back to the dance again. See again, the pause shot. I'll show you. Okay, hold there, keep, keep going, you three. What I want you to do, you're gonna, I don't want you to pause here and then shoot it. What I want you to do is flow through and shoot it one motion. So go six and finish, ready? So start out with the ball, bring it up. Don't pause. So you're gonna go through. Six. So build the speed up on the six. Go. Good. Go again. More backspin. More backspin. Good, good. Nice. Go, go, go. Here we go. Okay, this time. You can play a little game now. So start on the charge circle. What we're aiming for. This is the swish game. What we want is someone to make an NBA three tonight. So what will happen is if I shoot it and I swish it, okay, I miss, so I stay where I am right now. If I shoot it, I swish it, I get to take a step back. If I swish that, I take another step back. If I miss it, I take a step in. If I miss it, I take a step in. If I hit the ring, I stay where I am. Everyone got me? All the way back. Actually, we'll make it to the three point line. You make a switch from here, and you're first to do it, you win the game. Go, 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 switch game. Quick, quick. Lock in, lock in. Good, good, here we go. Good. Rim, reason, remedy. Concentrate on the focus here. Here we go. Nice job. Good. Don't lean back. Lock in, lock in. Good. One step back. Yeah, one step back on a swish. Good. Another swish, nice job. This, is, this little game is to try and, again, emphasize technique and form so that they're getting consistency with what they're doing and try and read and what, watch the flight of the ball each time. See, to me, with this group of young players, this has to be an absolute focus. I, the, the, to me, there's not a pure shooter here. So what, what we need to do is keep breaking this down and spend half an hour or more, even full sessions of practice getting this right. So that, that way, they get the, build their shooting lines, they build their form, and then develop their form, okay?
Close, getting close down here. Quick, go, 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 go. Let's go, lock, knock him down, knock him down. Swish, we want a couple of swishes here. Good, good. Okay, we got 10 seconds to go. 10 seconds to go. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and stop. Okay, hold there. Do you notice the steps started getting bigger as the clock went down? Okay, back down this end, guys, quickly, let's go. What we're gonna do now, one rebound and one shooter. So one rebound and one shooter. What we're gonna do now is just work on, we're gonna, we're gonna pound the ball. So you're gonna throw it to me. I'm gonna catch it in the air. I'm gonna pound it, I'm gonna sidestep, and I'm gonna shoot it, okay? We're just building a little bit here. So let's have one look at this, here we go. So catch, pound, separate, good, nice job. Form was good, both ends, let's go, quick, quick. Stay in pair. Pound, sidestep, let's get some separation on that now. So sidestep, separate, chase it. Sidestep, chase it, good, good, here we go. Nice job. I'm starting to like what I'm seeing on the other side there. Pound, don't separate. See how you're flat, elbow below your eye, elbow above your eye, elbow above your eye. Good, nice job. Here we go. How am I going time-wise, am I? One minute. One minute to go, okay. Go, 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 go. Good. Okay, this end, quick, quick, let's go. Jump over here, guys. Come this way. I want you to grab a ball each quickly. Grab a ball each quickly. Come over this way, come over this way. Make a line straight along here. Give yourself a bit of room. You're just gonna quickly face everyone over here. Face this way, face this way. Move back a little bit, move back a little bit. What I want you to do is show me the perfect shot now. What are you working on? What are you working on from tonight? Yep. Hand so, yeah, hand positioning. So find the valve, find the valve with your index finger. That's yeah. your thumb. That's it, good, good. Now, to the side. What are you, how are you, how are you engaging your legs? Good, good. Yep, see how the ball's starting on this side. Use a simple technique, you hit the knee, lift the ball through your eye, ready? Hit the knee, hit your knee. So which knee, right knee, go hit the knee. So now it's coming through. So you're moving the ball around. I want you to go straight and get that index figure through your line. Let's go, lift, good. Not bad, ball on the palm a little bit. So lift it off your palm, off your palm, off your palm. So go up to shoot it. Little technique, so you're rolling back, stay forward. So use, your, use here, use your glutes, yep. Now we're lifting the ball up to shoot it. I want you to roll the ball back, okay? Now shoot it. Better, here we go. Stay forward, okay, hold there. You go. This, this foot wants to go this all the time. Stay straight, go. Not, not bad, still that turning of your shoulder. Keep, so shooting line, here, finish, go. Next one. Yeah, yeah, because you bring the ball to the other side. Widen your feet a bit. How big are those feet? It's a good thing. You're gonna grow, it's good. Here we go, lift. Good, nice job. I think that's pretty good. Do it again. Nice, excellent. Here we go. What did you do at the end? See that separation here means your elbow's below your eye. So you lock in, bring that through, elbow above your eye. Lock in, good, nice job. You still rolled your back. Stay forward, do it again, one more time. Stay forward, good, nice job. Here we go. Good. Have, make sure look at make sure you're looking like think you're looking at the ring. Here we go. Where, where does the ball start? What side of your body? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So again, shooting line. What I shoot? I'm gonna shoot through my shooting line. Go. Good. Nice job. Next one. Here we go. Good. Nice. Here we go. Okay. What did you do? Ring's not behind you. Where, where the, what did you do? Ro you roll back, okay? Keep it in front. Finish in front. So you, again, see what's happening here. Knees are rolling forward. So lock, so use your glutes, lock, lock down. Go, lock down, stay foot better. Here we go. Good, hey, I love the backspin. Now, you, now you've got to connect. So kinetic flow, 
What you're gonna do is connect feet, quads, all the way through glutes, here we go. See again, you're still here. I want you to lift your hips, come through, finish, go. Give him a clap, I think he, that's very good. That's much better, here we go. What did you do there? Roll back, sit forward, engage, come through, go. So what did you see from the first time we did it? Is there an improvement? Needs more, but it's a, I think it's a step in the right direction. Create the shooting lines, create the hand positioning, uh, make sure they're not rolling back the kinetic flow, the kinetic energy through the floor, okay? And, uh, young lady named Isabel Borlase. Um, she, she won sixth player of the year, whatever, or rookie of the year in the WNBL. She, 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 she leant back and basically they had that tilt and follow through here. Um, she got to the point it was so consistent. Um, all, I, all I would say is just, again, engage, your, activate your hips, sit forward a bit. And that little change would help her start to make shots. But everyone's different. So I, I, I allow her to lean back a little bit. So, yes. With shooting? Yep, yep. I, I used to run a program called, uh, I think it was uh, Cougar Cubs. The four-year-olds. So the four-year-old would come out on the floor to shoot it and they'd shoot two hands. I'd be like, get that, get that hand under here, this one on the side, and shoot it with one hand. So I, as soon as I can. And I, another thing on top of that, players at 26, 27, I've coached, I've changed. And I believe I've had success with it. What you do, you, you don't lose your natural eye at the ring. But if you create a, some form with softer hands and more powerful legs, you create, you create better shooters. So you don't lose your eye. So people say don't tamper with techniques if they're good. I, I, I challenge this like a Sarah, I've had a lot to, a lot to do with Sarah Blixabs in her time. Um, I got to the point where I had to find new way of challenging her. So it'd be 20 in a row from five spots from behind the three point line. So you just gotta keep finding ways of challenging people and, and making them better that way. So, yep. The jump, uh, once they've done this, once they can set shoot, uh, and different people are like, to, to, to do a jump shot is to a set point and then release. So it's a, it's a different shot. Um, most, in my time watching, like, the mid-range game's gone out of the game a little bit and it shouldn't have. Uh, in my time, the Sandy Brondellos, the Gina Stevens, the elite female, the best players could shoot a jump shot. So the jump shot's next after this, once they can do a set one. What are your thoughts on the connection between the two dominant styles of shooting between fingertips out of the palm and the three points compared to your push shot from A to B with the ball in the palm? Yeah, no, I, um, Peter talked about Shane Heal today, how he used to push the ball up onto the fingers and that way, you, you, you just generate more backspin. If I've got it on the base of my palm, I have to go from here all the way to the end to go. I can get it away quicker if I snap my wrist. So I, 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 I get it off the base of the palm straight away. I just, the only reason I ask is because I read a few things about generating power yep. for, we call it weaker shooters, yeah. actually, yep. and that they do that to generate more torque on the ball. But yep. I just, and what, what I would say there is, if you find that it works for somebody, yeah. Not one size doesn't fit everyone, so I'm I'm trying to, yeah, yeah, that's right. So if you find a way, like Isabel Bolle, she leans back and finishes, it works. So, and she's getting 20 in a row. So it's kind of, you, you, if you get into that standard, you don't want to change it too much.